For the past 20 years, Google is the crowned king of search engines. The most profitable, large software business is search. If you look at Google's business, they have the best business model ever invented on earth ever for a for-profit company. It just rains money. Many multi-millions dollar companies tried to compete with Google, but ultimately, they all lost to Google. Many thought that Google is firm in their field, and no one can replace it from the way. But this time, its competitor was none other than ChatGPT, which is an AI chatbot. This AI chatbox was not only a sign of danger for Google, but also for many other industries which in the upcoming future AI will destroy. But what is this chat GPT? How does it benefit working class people? Why does Google scare of it? And which industries would be harmed by this chatbot in the upcoming future? We will know all of this in today's video, so make sure to subscribe. Welcome to Fact Frenzy. Viewers, the prediction of Stephen Hawking's is looking to come true. Before his death, he said that in the upcoming time, artificial intelligence will become much stronger than human intelligence. And human intelligence will look nothing in front of them. In short, he said that robots will overcome humans and probably the war has started. In 1997, Google search engine was launched from this small room. The reason that Google is being leading the search engine game for the last 20 years is due to its fast and accurate results. 90% of whole world searches are done through Google. From searching for a movie review to finding new recipes and finding information for a school project, everyone uses Google for it. There are some child companies of Google such as Gmail, YouTube, and AdSense, but still, 60% of their revenue comes through their search engine. In today's time, the total worth of Google's empire is more than $1.15 trillion, but still, they feel so much insecure that they have issued an internal red code. According to Business Insider, Google has reportedly issued a red code amid the rising popularity of ChatGPT. ChatGPT is a chatbot that gives answers to any questions in just a few seconds. But Google can also do this then, why do they feel so much insecure? Answering fast is not a problem for Google, but the problem is while finding information on Google, we have to visit so many websites. And while we find the correct information, we already have visited dozens of websites. But if we ask the same problem from the chatbot, it will answer it with so much detail in less than 10 seconds. And it doesn't matter that it is complicated questions of physics or mathematics or the correction of a false code in programming. It has so much power that it could make a whole source code in less than 5 seconds. These are some features that we could not find on any other websites. If we say that ChatGPT is a qualified teacher, we won't be wrong. ChatGPT has already passed the papers of United States Medical Licensing Exam, Bar Exam, and MBA. And after seeing these extraordinary capabilities of ChatGPT, it was able to grab the attention of millions of people overnight. And 10 million people used ChatGPT in just two months. The users which ChatGap was able to grab in two months take nine months for TikTok, 30 months for Instagram, while 17 months for Uber and Google Translate. And as we discussed earlier that 60% of Google's revenue comes from search engine and ChatGPT become a threat to it. And one more thing that hurts Google the most is the company that made ChatGPT. Yes, ChatGPT is made by OpenAI. But there is another company behind it, and it is Microsoft. That Microsoft who have its own search engine by the name of Bing. It was 2019 in which Microsoft invested $1,000 million in OpenAI. And from then these two companies are working on many projects together. One of its project is to create a pictures of your choice using AI bot. This project is known as Dolly. After the massive success of ChatGPT and Dolly, Microsoft announced that they will integrate these two services into its own search engine. And this announcement was not less than a nightmare for Google. We all know that in the world of IT, anyone who provides better service, people will use them because they are just one click away to shift. It was just a decade back when Facebook replaced Google's social media platform, Orkut. Now then, if Google wants to secure its search engine business model, then they must do something soon. In December 2022, Google issued Code Red, and just after a month and a half, 
Google announced that they will launch its own AI bot named Bard to compete with ChatGPT. CEO of Google indicated in one of its blog that Google's AI bot will be more intelligent than ChatGPT. That means that in upcoming time there will be competition between these two AI bots, which is the starting of an AI war. AI bots not only transfer the information feeded in them, but they also have the ability to think. As human intelligence improve with passage of time, AI intelligence can also improve their intelligence. As of today, AI bots don't have feelings, but it is possible that in upcoming time, they will also produce feelings in them, which can be very dangerous for the world. Meanwhile ChatGPT and other chatbots have positive points, but at the same time, they are very harmful for humans. The biggest loss would be for writers, programmers, and call center industries. In the end, it's up to us to determine the role of AI in our future. Will we allow it to dominate our world? Or will we find a way to integrate it into our society in a way that benefits us all? Till then, peace.